Welcome back. A major win on Jeopardy tonight hit very close to home. A local high school senior beat 17,000 people for the chance to play in the game show's teen tournament finals. As Fox 21's Kerry Aiken tells us, the final episode aired tonight. From a nerve-wracking silence to this. He is the champion by a margin of $100 here. 75000 for David Walter. I was in shock because I was down by so much and I you know there wasn't I didn't have a huge chance of winning so to come from behind like that it was kind of like whiplash. A whiplash moment as 17 year old David Walter of Wilmington found out he was taking home first place in Jeopardy's teen tournament. David says he was focused from the start. And once stuff started taping and once the game started taping I know at least I just kind of rolled with it and got calm and uh, it wasn't so bad because you don't want to think about how many people are watching it. Other than the millions of viewers nationwide, family and friends gathered Friday night to watch the final round of competition. David says it was an honor just to be on stage with such talented people. It's not just that you're smart, but it's also like a different a kind of mental wavelength where you're all really quick and like, you know, things are flying in the air. So the kind of conversations you have with people when they're all just so sharp and so smart was, um, I think everyone kind of appreciated that. Everyone can appreciate this. Going into the final round Friday, David was behind by $26,000, but he came back to win by $100. A comeback they were told was the biggest in Jeopardy history. Carrie Aiken, WBOC News, Wilmington. David took home $75,000 for that win. He says it's going to pay for his four years at Princeton University and also for some travel.